Okay, I'm back, guys. Sorry, I just, I just had to set my timer, because I want to start to have timers now so I know how long my videos are. Um, okay. Oh, God, this is a bit laggy. I'm sorry for that. Well, I believe I did save my guy to the bin. And hold on, let me just make sure there's nothing around here that can make it laggy, because that sometimes happens. It's fine, though. Um, doo -doo. oh, here he is. Wow, he's already here. And you can see by his hair color, he has neon pink hair with purple highlights and pink eyes. Now, then, as you can see, it's more of a nerdy nerd nerd. Now, then, there are two ways you can do this with the traits, but, but there's only one trait that you have to keep. It is, um, just like children. So then I'm going to be randomizing this thing once. And then I'm going to pick a number, almost like what Landros did, from, um, 1 through 5. And whatever number that is, even if it's good, whatever case that is, even if it's good or bad, will be become dislikes children. Hopefully he loads up. In a minute or so. Okay, come on now. Oh my gosh, how long is this gonna take? But anyways, how have you guys been? I just made over 50 subscribers and I'm very happy for that. Like, I love you all so much. Oh my gosh, oh, oh, oh. Is it starting? Oh, please. Okay, good, he's here. Okay, we're gonna do this. Okay, now then, here's our sim. His name is Logan Hoskins. And here is what he looks like. Hopefully, hopefully we're gonna zoom in on his face. Yep, as you can see, his purple hair. Oh, wow, I didn't change his hair, but I actually sort of like that hair. I don't know why. It's a base game here. I actually never changed his hair, which is pretty weird for me. That's nah, fine. I actually like it on him. He looks more nerdy, but we don't know what his traits are going to be yet. Oh, we don't, there, there is no traits yet. Okay. So then, ready? The trait that's in the fourth spot. Whatever trait that is, even if it's good or bad, we are be changing it. Oh, wow. He's never nude. Oh, that's gonna be interesting oh Jesus I'm a little worried about that now uh fourth spot he's never nude and dislikes children and what we're gonna go for the fr oh wow that's gonna be hard um We'll go for maybe. <laughs> I don't know which one I want to do. Let's go with this one. Let's do it a bit. Right, maybe this. Look for six tombs in each location. Oh my god, this is so hard to choose from. Let's just do private museum. Okay, so then here's Logan Hoskins. Never nude and dislikes children and a light sleeper. Oh, kill me now, please. Oh, Jesus, sorry. Oh my god, I am really scared right now. Like, you don't know how scared I am that we're not going to get very far in this challenge. Um, so yeah. Oh my god, this is like really laggy and I am really sorry. Oh my god. 
Okay, good. Now then, there is already a two-bedroom house here in, um, in Springs, which is perfect. Absolutely perfect. And I am hoping that within the first day or so, we can get a wife and start off with the gener- and start off with the kids, because we can't move on to the second generation until we find the perfect gen genetics. Which means we're gonna need, if it doesn't happen in his lifetime, then the challenge is over. So we have to find ways. So he's gonna probably become a doctor, and I'm gonna get him into the chemistry lab station. Just so we have that. And I am so sorry for how laggy this is. Oh, this is actually really, really bad. <laughs> It never usually happens. I don't know. Here, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. Sorry. Um. Okay, yeah, I'm back. Um. Hopefully, this is working better. I gave it some time to just relax a bit. So, yeah. Yeah. So that's all we can do. I know, it's a little sad, but it's fine, that'd be perfect, okay, so anyway, okay, we just got that, social stuff, don't care, don't care, okay, and then we do have elixir, um, Alistair's elixirs and sun dries, uh, and then also we have Vogue's cavern close, so I have Paul A. Wilkes Natural Museum, which we might head over to today. Hans Tavern and Cafe. So yeah, um, and here's where the Weatherstone is. It is all the way over near the science facility. Uh, I said before, I really want him to be a doctor. Uh, um, and surprisingly, it's not that far away from here. And also, let me just quickly... I want to hold one of these houses that after the sims die in it, it's going to be probably become ours. Unless if I want to put in a custom-made house. Like, for, like, generations. Because those things actually fit really good in, these, in this town. Yeah, so he's off. Um, and okay. So then, hopefully I can just get through the day of him. Sorry. Okay. So anyway, where are we? Okay, yep, we're gonna have him join that. We're gonna have him head over to the library to set up a, um... Crap, only 24 days. I never even changed this. That's fine, actually. Set up a, uh, account. And, well, since I'm talking to you on Skype, shout out to Freezy Bunny Arcade. He just hit 100 subscribers, so then... I know probably all of you are subscribed to him, but if any of you guys aren't, go subscribe to him. He's awesome. He's like my best friend on YouTube, and he says hey bitches. <laughs> okay, so then, what's your, I forget his name already. Logan. Logan, you have to head over to the library. Because maybe you can find some bitches and be all like, hey, I have pink hair. I'm so cool. <laughs> I don't know, maybe. I wish he was a bookworm. Okay, now then, he does not have good traits at all for online dating. Which is not good. But I'm gonna have to edit up his profile a bit. Which, you know, might not be that bad, but... Anyway, here is the, um, library in Hidden Springs. Now, then, Hidden Springs is a, um, town that comes from the Sims 3 store. It is actually a really nice library. I've never really played in Hidden Springs. It's very open and spacious, which I really like. And we do have, like, a giant kid area, which is perfect. Um, where would the books be that have all the, um different things. Do you, would you, anyone know? I feel like it'd be over here because it's the only different one. It's not. Okay, this is a little weird. 
Mm, this is Brasm. Three, any of these? Nope, there's none of them down there, so we're just gonna browse these. Don't know if this is one or two, but okay. As he's doing this, as I'm doing this, I don't waste too much time. Not only dating, create a profile. Okay, good. Uh, we're gonna browse, 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 browse. Okay, so we have the first one. No. Second one, nothing. Third one, nothing. Fourth one, nothing. Fifth one, nothing. Sixth one, nothing. Seven one, nothing. Eight one, nothing. Wow. Okay, so then, we're gonna be, okay, we're gonna probably just like children never nude, and we'll put in vehicle enthusiast and vegetarian, who really cares? Uh, he's not athletic, I don't actually know, so I'm gonna put him as slim, and then we're gonna, I'm not dead, and where are you? Here you are, who the hell is this? Okay, he's not gay. Um, okay, good. Oh, whoops, I didn't want to check messages. I wanted to send messages. Then hopefully you can find the bookshelf in here that has everything. I, oh, oh, there's two over here that I didn't check yet. Oh, oh, we have someone named Adele. And then, <clears throat> Let's do it for the mall to load. It doesn't look that bad. But we need a... But we need someone. Francesca. Ooh, Joel doesn't look that bad. What am I saying? She actually looks hideous. Yeah, it's in Vanna. Are there any good people in here? Maybe how on that? No, 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 no. I really don't know. <laughs> okay, they all look older, which is not good for me. Um, I have to say that the cutest one is probably Helena, but she's probably a bit bigger, but. She has probably the best traits I've seen. So Helena will go with you. And then we'll just get her athletic. And not gonna be that bad. Okay, I actually didn't check inside of these. Okay. One downfall to the oh wait, 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 yep. One downfall to this library. This one does not have any books that are readable with the skills. Wait, who's this? Jewel. Oh, this is Jewel. Jewel. And sadly, there's no books in here that are readable. So, if you're getting it in spring, just think about that. Okay, so then with that and that. Uh, let's see, we have Performance Park over there. We need to find a place that has some sort of logic. And I believe at the Alpine Square, which is their central park, it's not the best. It's like pavement. Not very good. But I believe they have tele. I believe they have um. Uh, some I believe they do. Thought they did. Oh, that's stupid. Ow, my head. Oh god, my head hurts now. Ow. Oh my god, that's really dumb. <laughs> what? Like really dumb. Who's here? Chesterfield House? Bruce Chesterfield, that's a funny name. Bruce. Okay, here. Actually, here, there's something cool about the, um, here, but I don't think there are anything good here. But, like, you go inside of here and, like, sleep and stuff. The room has a computer. Uh, I'm just checking around right now. In case. Nope. But, 
we are at the library, so then we can play chess because they actually have good computers. Not a lot of, not a lot of the libraries in Missing Three have them good computers. We're gonna be oops, playing uh, chess. So we can get up that thing. So yeah. Let me just go check the timer. I may play a little bit more than the time allotted. I don't know. It depends. After you get to one skill, I think he'll be fine. He really will be fine. But we, I just need that one skill, so at least he can like, be ready. Okay, we have to find some cute people for him. Well, let's see, there is Jewel, but we saw her picture. Okay, let's see. I don't really care. Um, here's what she looks like in the real. She doesn't look that bad. So wait. Well, she has a unique kind of hair to her. Uh, not a lot of cuties here. Oh wow, too friendly. Maybe she's a girl. Felicia. Ooh. I think we might have found our person. We don't really chat. Get over here. I'm gonna lose no Ooh, who the hell is this? Layla. Layla. Okay. I'm hopefully gonna get the the mascot. We are seducing the mask. <laughs> but everyone else in this town is but ugly, and the mask are already dead generic, kind of cute them. And then hopefully we get there soon, and we live very far away, and with our pink hair, it's not very hard not to notice us. Sorry, <clears throat> I had to yawn there. Um, okay, we might have got a little bit of jock. I don't really care about That's to hang out. And because she's a mascot, we might be able to, t t to teach our kids that could be like a training thing throughout the hair. Air. Felicia Kane. I don't know where I got that from. I don't know. Okay. And may I please? Okay. Not laggy. There we go. Wow. I guess she likes us. God, she's flirty. I don't know how well this is going to work out. But you never know. Leo! Okay, now then, obviously, we don't want to get her for a little bit. Uh, put up a little bit more. We'll try the first kiss. But then after that, after the romantic interest, we'll at least be somewhere close. Dating the mascot. Can you get any more? Can you get any worse? Oh. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Single romantic flirtation joke. I mean, she's probably not single. I mean, she probably is single. <laughs> I 
It's funny how we're dating the mascot. It's just like, oh yeah. Oh, that's my timer. Um, let's just go for another like ten minutes. Maybe seven, seven, seven more minutes. Okay, good. After a nice massage, leap into your arms. Now, do you want to stay over? Oh, you're a bitch. I hate you. Apologize. Oh my god, okay. But now then we have to just... Oh, we have to get become friends with her. University mascot? You? Oh, you are a jock. Oh, with that, I just see everyone's getting stuff. Ella Carlisle looks like a bear looking woman. I feel like Felicia and Ryder Hopkins will be good. You want to kiss an Aladdin Scout travel with? Obviously, we're going to probably have to do that one day. I'll pick up a little bit. Someone personality. Compliment appearance. Well, <laughs> flirt it up a little bit more, and then we'll do the heat of the moment kiss. Please work. I need this to work. Oh, Jesus. Oh, wow, well, you're a failure. Okay, I apologize. They're like, I'm sorry. I could not. How about a new job? Be a little funny. I don't know if you have a good sense of humor. You don't. Oh, crap. Okay, well, I think we have to probably send her home. We've gotten better with her. His hair just is so awesome. I don't know why. Mm. Say goodbye. We better not have a bath. Thank God. Okay, uh, shower. Have a quick meal of green salad. And then you can have to bed, which will be the end. Other than sorry for such a long episode. Hopefully my mic isn't terrible. Because trust me, if it is, I am very sorry. But hopefully you've all enjoyed this part. <clears throat> I've enjoyed it. It's nice to explain it. And I think the perfect genetics challenge is going to be great. Ooh, they're friends. That's even better. Okay, you're going to clean up like a good boy. Mm-hmm. And then we're going to have you head off to bed. And thank God for such a good thing. Okay, now then, he never did finish his logic skill, which sort of scares me. I should go to sleep. Oh, he's absent-minded. That's always fun. But anyway, I don't know how much more time's left. Um, three minutes. I think we are done. So yeah, guys, so then in the next part, we will be after work. We will be inviting over Felicia and trying to get girlfriend, boyfriend, and maybe even married. So we can just get right to the baby making because we need the babies. So because we need to get him as far up as we can in this before it's too late. And probably we'll get her up to level 10 in the jock, be have her become the sports thing so we can tie a little bit of university life into it. I mean, we are getting the mascot, or seducing the mascot. And this is going to be kind of like the baby room. We're going to have baby things and everything. It's going to be fun. 
And so no matter we will be getting a new a new house and all that after probably have like a couple kids. So yeah guys, I hope you all having a super awesome, amazing, fabulous day. And stay strong. Love you all, bye. Hi everyone, this is the Big Cemetery and welcome to part one of a new LP I'm doing. Now then, first of all, let me just say, hope my mic sounds better. Sort of tweak the quality a little bit. Hopefully it sounds good. Um, and also, the reason why I don't have any more videos on my YouTube channel is because I want to start fresh. I mean, I loved my videos, but I just didn't have fun making them. And if I don't have fun, I feel like you guys don't have fun. So anyway, we are in the beautiful town of Hidden Springs for a new challenge I'm going to do. Now then, this challenge is um, a challenge that Landeros is doing, who is my favorite YouTuber ever. If you're not subscribed to him, go subscribe. It is the perfect genetics challenge. Now then, as I'm getting my sim that I created for this household, I mean for this challenge, let me just tell you the rules about it. Now then, the perfect genetics challenge is just like, um, is just like the legacy, except, um, you, their, your founder's genetics have to have a weird hair color and weird eye color that, um, that all the other sims must also have. And hold on guys, I'll be right back. I had one back. Uh, sorry. Oh, it's a bit smoother. Um, I had to do a couple things. Okay. Mm, not that much smoother. Oh. But anyway, we'll just try to ignore that, and we're gonna move into this place called the Gypsy Hideaway. It is. We're gonna probably take it unfurnished, and it is a two-bedroom, one bath. Now then, obviously, because he wants to be a private museum person, we'll need to have him travel, which we'll probably do later on in his life, but after we try to get the perfect genetics. Now then, obviously, if the first child is into genetics, I am so lucky. But, he might not. Or he might not, so whatever happens, happens with that. Let's just get into the game. Yay! Um, hopefully this video is around 25 minutes long. That's what I'm setting it for. Um, because that's where I feel most of the uh, awesomeness will be within. <laughs> um, yeah. Ugh. Hopefully we get into things. Good part of the game. Okay, there we are. And we don't care about no weather stone. Wonder how we brought already? Wow. Nice little gypsy hideaway. It's very small. I got unfurnished, which is even better for me. Um. Oh, 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 okay, okay. Come on, let's get working. Okay. Obviously, we need a nice, we need, we don't really need a, an amazing diamond right now. We need, not oh, big enough for him. And upstairs, we're going to give him a decent bed. Um, no, definitely not any of those. I'm gonna give him this. Mm. 
three right there, and then that's what we're gonna be doing. I want him to at least get him a good bed by this part. Now then, um, uh, okay, yeah, because I need that. I know. Okay, anyway, it's the start of a new day, and hold on guys, I'll be right back. Sorry for all the cuts, but I need to.